you had time to help with an urgent delivery. You sound as if you could use some help. Oh, yes, I could. Eddie Thistlewood's the name. A dear friend of mine in Feldcroft is at his wit's end due to the relentless attacks on his hamlet by Ranrock and his loyalists. I sent two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages to help, but they've gone missing. Good idea. Those cabbages are nothing to be trifled with. My thoughts precisely. You see, I know plants, and I believe the goblins will be so irritated by the onslaught of ferocious vegetation, they'll simply leave Feldcroft alone. I wonder if you might track the two crates down and deliver their contents to my friend Bernard Indiai. I simply can't leave my shop at present. Why would the goblins target Feldcroft? My friend Bernard says they've been seen in the area for a while. He seems to think they're looking for something. But lately, they've become more aggressive. Very well, sir. I shall keep an eye out for two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. Oh, thank you. I shall let Bernard know he might be receiving those cabbages after all. I should be going now. Thank you. I'm convinced that Feldcroft will be much safer with Chinese chomping cabbages defending them. It's like a place right out of a storybook. That crate of Chinese chomping cabbages is somewhere in this camp. Revelio. For as snooty as Upper Hogsfield is, I'll get that goblin house back. You and those person sentinels at the level. You're the little sons of Satan. Want me to address you? Do cooperate, won't you? Revelio. That's one crate in hand. I only need one more.
I can see why Feldcroft needs. Banrock's lawyers are hiding out near Feldcroft. That's all of the crazy trainers talking to you. I'd better go and see Mr. Thistlewood's friend in Feldcroft. I wonder who lives here. Hello there. Do you have a special delivery for my dear friend, Eddie? Hello, Mr. Ndai. Eddie Thistlewood sent me. Yes, he told me to expect you. Do you have the Chinese chomping cabbages? I have them right here. Marvelous. This will go a long way towards protecting the hamlet from Ranrock's loyalists. The same foul curs who, I'm willing to guess, intercepted them in the first place, along with Rookwood's lot. Feldcroft owes a debt of gratitude to you and Eddie. Thank you for your help. You're welcome. Happy to be of assistance. At last, some reinforcements. Hopefully this is enough to thwart the goblins. <laughs> <laughs> 